The F-35 Lightning II is considered the most modern fighter jet in the world. The jet, made by U.S. manufacturer Lockheed Martin, is considered more than just a fighter aircraft. It's essentially an armed computer with a jet engine that can network with other aircraft in the air as well as ground forces, processing thousands of pieces of information every second. In this video, we're going to take a more detailed look at the F-35 to see what makes it so special. The Lockheed Martin F-35 Lightning II is a latest-generation single-seat, single-engine, all-weather stealth multi-role combat aircraft that delivers advanced capabilities, enabling pilots to operate in any environment and against any threat. The multi-role F-35 family includes three variants, the F-35A conventional takeoff and landing variant, the F-35B short takeoff slash vertical landing variant, and the F-35C carrier variant. The variants are all highly capable and feature the same avionics, allowing armed forces to achieve specific mission capability. The aircraft's first flight was on the 15th of December 2006, and in July 2015, the F-35B entered service with the U.S. Marine Corps, followed by the U.S. Air Force F-35A in August 2016, and the U.S. Navy F-35C in February 2019. The aircraft was first used in combat in 2018 by the Israeli Air Force. The F-35 is manufactured in several places, but Air Force Plant 4 Fort Worth is at the heart of the operation. The midsection is built at a Northrop Grumman plant in California, and the plane's tail is built in the United Kingdom, which is the United States' closest F-35 partner. These pieces come together for final assembly in Fort Worth, where the front section is manufactured. There are also final F-35 assembly facilities in Italy and Japan. The F-35 measures 15.6 meters in overall length, has a wingspan of 10.7 meters and a height of 4.36 meters, and when empty, the aircraft weighs 29,300 pounds. Thanks to its Pratt & Whitney F-135 afterburning turbofan engine, the top speed comes in at 1.6 Mach or 1,200 miles per hour. That is 1.6 times the speed of sound, and its maximum thrust tops 40,000 pounds. The jet has a range of 900 nautical miles and a combat radius of 833 kilometers. The Lightning has a maximum G rating of 7 Gs, which can be compared to the G-force felt in Apollo 16 on re-entry to Earth, measuring 7.19 Gs. The standard weapons payload of all three F-35 variants includes two AIM-120C-D air-to-air missiles and two 1,000-pound GBU-32 JDAM guided bombs, allowing the F-35 to engage both airborne and ground-based targets. The main differences between naval variants and the other versions of the Joint Strike Fighter are associated with the carrier operations. The internal structure of the naval version is very strong to withstand the high loading of catapult-assisted launches and tailhook arrested landings. The aircraft has larger wing and tail control surfaces for low-speed approaches for carrier landing. Larger leading edge flaps and foldable wingtip sections provide a larger wing area, which provides an increased range and payload capacity. The canopy, radar, and most of the avionics are common to the three variants. The F-35's mission systems are among the most complex aspects of the aircraft. The avionics and sensor fusion are designed to enhance the pilot's situational awareness and command and control capabilities and facilitate network-centric warfare. The F-35 has the most advanced sensor suite of any fighter in history, including the active electronically scanned arrays radar, which provides long-range intelligence. The distributed aperture system, which sends high-resolution real-time imagery to the pilot's helmet from six infrared cameras mounted around the aircraft. The electro-optical targeting system combines forward-looking infrared and infrared search and track functionality. And the advanced helmet-mounted display system provides pilots with unmatched situational awareness in diverse conditions. The glass cockpit was designed to give the pilot good situational awareness. The main display is a 20 by 8 inch panoramic touchscreen which shows flight instruments, stores management, CNI information, and integrated caution and warnings. Below the main display is a smaller standby display. The cockpit has a speech recognition system and instead of a heads up display, all flight and combat information is displayed on the visor of the pilot's helmet. 
These helmets were made at a cost of $400,000 each. The ejection seat is launched by a twin catapult system housed on the side rails. For life support, an onboard oxygen generation system is fitted and powered by the integrated power package, with an auxiliary oxygen bottle and backup oxygen system for emergencies. Stealth is a key aspect of the F-35's design, and radar cross-section is minimized through the careful shaping of the airframe and the use of radar-absorbent materials. Visible measures to reduce radar cross-section include alignment of edges, serration of skin panels, and the masking of the engine face and turbine. Additionally, the F-35's diverterless supersonic inlet uses a compression bump and forward-swept cowl, rather than a splitter gap or bleed system, to divert the boundary layer away from the inlet duct, eliminating the diverter cavity and further reducing radar signature. So rather than being invisible, the F-35 has the ability to elude or greatly complicate an enemy's ability to find and destroy it. The F-35 is expected to be continually upgraded over its lifetime. The first upgrade program, called the Continuous Capability Development and Delivery, also known as C2-D2, began in 2019 and is currently planned to run to 2024. The near-term development priority of C2-D2 would integrate additional weapons, including those unique to international customers, refresh the avionics, improve ESM capabilities, and add remotely operated video enhanced receiver support. C2-D2 also places greater emphasis on agile software development to enable quicker releases. The Lightning's price per unit, including ancillary costs like depot maintenance, ground support equipment, and spare parts, is a massive $110.3 million per F-35A, $135.8 million per F-35B, and $117.3 million per F-35C. These totals don't include the nearly $1.3 trillion in life cycle costs to operate and sustain the aircraft over its 66-year life cycle, making it the most expensive weapon system in U.S. history. Germany has decided to buy 35 F-35 fighters this year to bolster its air forces. This would mean they would be following in the footsteps of fellow NATO allies Belgium, Denmark, Italy, the Netherlands, Norway, Poland, the UK, and the US as F-35 customers, as well as non-NATO European countries Finland and Switzerland, which each ordered the jet in the last few months. Canada, an original F-35 development partner, is also believed to be leaning towards buying the F-35 this year. It took longer to come to fruition than originally planned, but in the end, the Joint Strike Fighter met its goals for survivability and versatility. That makes it one of the greatest engineering feats of the post-Cold War generation, a testament to the discipline and skill of the American aerospace industry. What do you think of the F-35 fighter? Do you think it's got what it takes? Let us know in the comments and please like this video if you've enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.